right, helpsters, our goal is to make a spooky story for Sophia to tell. Now, who's got an idea, huh? Oh. Huh? Oh, heart. If we want to tell a spooky story, then we need a spooky story. Yeah, you do. So job one, create a spooky story. Wait, is that it? One job? We wait, wait, got wait, 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 wait. Oh, Hold on. Perhaps there's more. Oh. Uh, there are ways we can make the story extra spooky. Ooh, Ooh, I love extra spooky. Well, you see, we are hearing the story with our ears. Mm -hmm. Is there anything to see with our eyes? Mm. Oh, see with our eyes. Mm. See with our mm. eyes. What about spooky lighting? Mm. Hey, mm. Yes, Sophia, yes. bringing it to the plan. So that's job two, make a spooky light. Okay, so what else would make a story extra spooky, huh? What about spooky sounds? What? I love spooky sounds. Me too, so that's job three, find spooky sounds. You know what, with all the spooky stuff, I think Lisa's gonna be spooked. Ah, <laughs> well then, storyteller Sophia, we have our plan. Mm -hmm. Excuse me? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Did somebody say all the jobs are done? Time to tell a story to Lisa? Wow, she is a good listener. Places, everybody! Oh, yeah. <laughs> all right, helpsters. If I point at you, then you make your noise, okay? Got yes. it. Lisa, are you listening? Always. Lights, sounds, story. Here we go. I was in a spooky house, and it was raining outside. I was eating a cookie. I wanted a glass of milk, so I opened my refrigerator door. Then I saw I was out of milk. 